This episode brought to you by Noble Gold. You know, it's a new year, time for new things. With a new administration in Washington, our friends at Noble Gold have all the protection you need. Security. Yeah, security. It's like damp proofing. It keeps the governments from your savings, like the damp from your floors. How? By using gold and silver in your own IRA. You insulate it from the markets. If anything bad happens, you're safe and dry. Protect with a gold IRA this month and Noble Gold will gift you this stunning solid silver Apollo 11 commemorative coin from the US Mint. So it's worth jumping on the phone and calling 877-646-5347 now. That's 877-646-5347. It's a, it's a good point you make about the threat. I mean, they were trying. The aim of the, the aim of those people was to over on the Capitol, maybe to execute legislators, take them hostage, definitely to stop a constitutional process. No one can accuse any Black Lives Matter or even Antifa protests of trying to do that last year. You remember the scenes in Portland, Oregon, where they were tear gassing people just for standing outside federal buildings or state buildings. So. Excuse me, uh, the, uh, the fuck did you just say? No one can accuse any Black Lives Matter or even Antifa protesters of trying to do that last year. You remember the scenes in Portland, Oregon, where they were tear gassing people just for standing outside federal buildings or state buildings. <laughs> what? No one can accuse any Black Lives Matter or even Antifa protests of trying to do that last year. You remember the scenes in Portland, Oregon, where they were tear gassing people just for standing outside federal buildings or state buildings. No way. We got you. Not a chance. You remember the scenes in Portland, Oregon, where they were tear gassing people just for standing outside federal buildings or state buildings. <laughs> Yeah, a total lie by Mr. Hassan over there at MSNBC. And look, this is just part of the larger narrative that the media, the Democrat Party state media, is really trying to push right now. Basically lobbing every accusation that we've been lobbing at them for the last six months. And they're doing this, obviously, just to inoculate themselves from the charge and giving themselves an excuse or a rationalization to uh, cheer on the suppression of their political opposition. It's just insane to me that they would lie so blatantly when the truth truth is so readily found. It's so easy to find, but it just shows that they realize that they're getting to enough people that it won't matter. I mean, just the other day, Fox had on the Portland mayor and he admitted that Antifa is a serious problem in their city. My good faith efforts at de-escalation have been met with ongoing violence and even scorn from radical Antifa and anarchists. Lawlessness and anarchy come at great expense and with great risk to the future of our community. It's time to push back harder 
against those who are set on destroying our community.